Hello beautiful people and welcome to my channel. I'm the Lush Master. It is so lovely to make your acquaintance and I look forward to getting to know you. And one of the ways that I would like to get to know you is in the comment section. So if you would answer one question for me, why are you here? And that would be so lovely. I know it's a very broad question, but without thinking too much about it, just answer that question for me. Why are you here? Reddit has been there for a very long time, but I've just discovered it, like it's new to me. And the thing that I love the most about Reddit is how things escalate from zero to 100. I know that's most of the internet. I know, probably 90% of the internet. I love how the conversation just moves, whoosh, and then it just becomes something else. I came across this conversation recently where someone posted the question why are you here now obviously like that could mean so many different things like it could be why are you in the world why are you on the internet why are you on reddit specifically at that time why are you on youtube right now watching my video i could like go on and on and on and on but the thing that was very apparent for me and i think that the thing that we like the most about the internet is that it's always awake, it's always available for you when you actually want to access it. That's if you have like a reliable internet connection and etc etc. That's not what I'm talking about. There's always going to be a question, uh, an answer to a question that you have, a friend on the other side of the screen, the advice that you need for that specific moment. So it's always, always available to us to access so here are some of the responses to the question that was posed one person said there's something about reddit that just clicks for me i've been here for so long now that it feels natural to open it and browse for like five minutes every now and again it's almost like checking whatsapp but instead of seeing what's going on with my family and friends i check what's going on with you all that is adorable it really makes me feel like I'm connecting with another person in another area of the world, at least for a brief moment, and that's great. That's fantastic. I've also formed an opinion about a ton of stuff I didn't even know about over the years, be it right or wrong. After that, I get to share it with my wife and it makes for profound, weird or funny, but never boring conversations. And that's always interesting. I love you guys. You really make my life a little better every day. Someone else said, one of the comments got too many upvotes and now I'm very satisfied with myself. And then it stayed online. And then another person said, baby and husband are asleep and it's the only time I get to feel like a human. So I'm reading up on everyone else's lives so I can live vicariously through them just one more person <laughs> i don't want to do my art assignment but that's just some of the many reasons why we access the internet consciously or subconsciously like we just click on youtube we click on reddit click on twitter whatever the platform is to either communicate with someone check in with someone or whatever the case may be. That's actually the question that I was asking you today. What was the first reason that made you access the internet today that led you up to here? Because I'm sure this is an escalation for you. I'm pretty sure this is my first video. You did not expect to see me on your timeline today, did you?